Hi, thanks for joining us. I'm Brant Kasbaum, sales engineer at ACI, joined today by Kurt Spackman from our technical support department to talk about our new line of power meters and CTs. So Kurt, why this new line of meters and CTs? What makes these different and better than what else is available in the marketplace? Sure. Uh, well, it's a more comprehensive product line uh, with a wider breadth of products being offered. It does have a, uh, a cost advantage as well. Uh, shorter lead times with a large inventory available right now here at ECI. Uh, it is a complete solutions-based package uh, with uh, additional enclosures available. And uh, so what types of applications are these meters best suited for? Uh, Submetering, for example, tenant billing would be another one. Uh, preventative maintenance is, a, is another application. Data logging, load trend analysis, power quality monitoring, renewable energy for uh, bi-directional monitoring applications would be another one. Yeah, that power or that preventive maintenance piece is very interesting because it seems like in recent years we've had customers use meters and CTs like these to not just provide status for equipment like what people would traditionally use a current switch for. Sure. Um, but that switch tells you when a, a piece of equipment is on or off or when that piece of equipment has failed. But people have been using these more and more frequently to trend and determine when that piece of equipment is in need of service. You know, bearings are worn out, belts are worn out, things like that before knowing that something has completely failed. Yeah. By so it seems like there's a, a wide range of applications where that would be useful. Yeah. For, for example, if you're monitoring the amperage load and as you see that amperage draw increase, you know, you could be potentially having a failed motor. Yeah, you got a bearing wear out yep, or something exactly. like that. Yep. Yep. When I've spoken to customers in the past about power meters and these types of applications, a lot of people tell me that they don't bid on those types of applications. They don't, this isn't their specialty. So what kind of support can we provide to help give our customers confidence that they can go out and go after that business and, and bid on these submetering and energy auditing types of applications? Well, as you know here at ACI, we, we pride ourselves on our, le our level of support that we offer customers. Uh, here, here in the tech support group and uh, the sales team, you know, we, we can help from bid to commissioning, uh, from helping you select the right meter and CTs for the application, uh, from the meter setup, programming, installation support, we can walk you through the entire process. So let's talk about the specific product. What meter and CT options are available in this product line? Sure. Well, essentially, there's, there's three different series of meters. Uh, it's going to depend on what the application is. Uh, for the right meter selection. Uh, basically, there's the, the three series are the KW1850, the KW320, and the KW350. Now, the KW1850 is going to be your uh, multi-circuit uh, meter. Uh, basically, it, it's able to monitor up to uh, six three-phase loads. And then the KW320 and 320 and 350 are going to be your single-circuit meters. Uh, there's a number of things that differentiates uh, one versus the other. Again, it depends on the application. Uh, basically, this the 320 is used for power quality monitoring. It uh, has a, a bunch of additional communication protocols. Uh, it has a 0.2 class accuracy, where the KW350 is your 0.5 class accuracy. has your serial communication protocols, BACnet, MSTP, Modbus, Modbus RTU. And uh, this, this one is for basic demand and KWH mm -hmm. monitoring. Now, your CT selection, there's essentially four different styles. You've got your, your hinged split core, your standard split core. You've got your rope style Rogowski coils. And then we also have a high accuracy solid core of uh, CT available. What are some of the specific features of these meters that differentiate them from competitive models? Sure. Well. Each one of the meters comes standard with an LCD display, every single unit, every single SKU. Um, all of them have uh, BACnet, MSTP, Modbus, RTU communication protocols um, with additional communication protocols with the KW1850 and the KW320. Uh, the application is going to determine what communication mm -hmm. protocol is going to be, be utilized. Uh, each one of these are, are revenue grade accuracy. Uh, for you know, tenant billing purposes would, would be an example. Um, all of them can be utilized for, with the exception of the multi-circuit meter for bi-directional monitoring for, let's say, a renewable energy application would, would be a scenario. Um, very easy to install, compact, uh, very intuitive software for, setting, for meter setup on all of these units. 
uh, which comes free with each one of the meters. And uh, enclosures, like I said uh, earlier, are available with each unit. Yeah, and Wi-Fi programming, if I understand correctly. Yeah, on a couple these can be programmed remotely over Wi-Fi instead the, of having to... These two units yep. here, yeah, the 320 and the 1850, that's correct. Very good. At the beginning, you mentioned that there are complete package solutions, including enclosures available. Which one of these meters, or are there multiple meters that are available with their own enclosures? Sure. Uh, well, one example of that would be the for the KW320, we have a uh, panel upgrade. And basically, what, what that panel is, is it's this meter mounted inside a NEMA 4 enclosure, all pre-wired with a power supply, a uh, pre-labeled CTs, industrial grade fuses, all prepackaged in a panel. So basically all the installer has to do is wire up the CTs and, and, and you're done. So it'll save you a, a ton of time on, during the installation, uh, prevent any sort of installation errors. Um, another example of that is each one of these meter, meters besides the panel upgrade, you can get enclosures for both of these for the 1850 and the KW350 as well. So that KW320 panel upgrade, that's all in one part number. So one, part. one SKU gets you a ready to install package. Yes, yes, it, it, it'll definitely simplify things during the installation process. It's, it's a, a great upgrade. Very good. Yeah. How can we learn more about these products, Kurt? Well, Brent, uh, all, all of our data sheets and instructions are now available on our website at workaci.com. Uh, in addition, we're happy to meet with you or any members of your team uh, to go over to the product uh, more in depth uh, uh, via webinar or in person. Uh, our team is also happy to cross-reference any competitors' products that you're currently using and come up with a uh, uh, solution for your application. Um, feel free to send any of your, your uh, upcoming projects, drawings, uh, things of that nature, and we'll, we'll come up with the best solution for, for your application. Yeah, thanks for joining us today, Kurt. And to, to conclude, I'll tag on what Kurt just said. When, when we talk about power meters and CTs, we look at these as a package solution. So when you're comparing to competitive devices, we want to look at not just meter versus meter. We want to look at system versus system. And Kurt and his team, as well as uh, me and all the rest of the sales engineers here at ACI, are happy to take a look at your drawings and your job specs to come up with a complete package solution that will use the least amount of devices at the lowest cost. If you've got questions at any time, please click on the chat box on our website, which is workaci.com. Most of the time, the chat box will take you directly to Kurt himself. Uh, any, of your, any of our sales engineers are happy to help at any time as well. Thanks again for joining us today, and we look forward to speaking with you again soon.